when it comes to uh, the fame scheme have they have you faced any kind of issues with fame too and is there has there been any recommendation from you to the government either to widen the scope uh, or maybe make some policy tweaks for the cv industry specifically not nothing any uh, uh, nothing of any significant nature from the cv industry point of view of course the buses uh, the city buses and uh, the lcvs were already part of fame too we would like that to continue because i think the industry needs uh, support for next uh, few more years uh, in this uh, in these two segments uh, in fame too we did not have the heavy duty trucks included last time and therefore we are hoping that the government would uh, also bring in heavy duty trucks under the fame uh, in terms of uh, long term policy clarity on alternate fuels hydrogen is a technology that ashok uh, leland has been working on closely uh, what kind of clarity uh, and long term policy stability are you expecting from the government see uh, on the hydrogen not so much from the technology point of view i think from the technology point of view i wouldn't say that the technology is mature right now but i think uh, with consistent effort from us and other industry players i think we can have a very mature technology in the next few years so that is not the area of concern i think there needs to be a little bit more discussion uh, with the government and within the industry associations about the availability of hydrogen also uh, i would say that uh, you know we normally boast ourselves by saying that we have the largest fleet of hydrogen ice trucks in the world although that number is very small uh but on the technology side i would say that you know we can get our hands around the technology very quickly in the next few years but yes like i said uh, more discussion is required on the availability the purity you know the kind of investments that we need to make and also as a ecosystem how do we develop this whole hydrogen economy in the country uh but do you feel that uh, lack of that discussion right now lack of that debate is somehow impacting Uh, the rollout plans and do you think that hydrogen as a technology especially in heavy commercial vehicles will be very important for 2030 onwards so i would say yes beyond 2030 or 2030 perspectives the discussion on hydrogen is very important especially i would say for heavy duty vehicles like commercial vehicles uh, i do think that in the near term electrification will play an important role yeah so i wouldn't say that any lack of discussion on hydrogen is impacting us really but i would say for uh hydrogen is a very prominent fuel that will appear that will be very helpful for the country and the industry in long run and therefore i would like to see a little bit more discussion happening on hydrogen as well